interlace our fingers, lock our hands, right? Get off of your shoes. A lot of people, lazy. You guys like to sit on your bottoms, don't you? Right? You guys much rather sit on your bottoms and go run laps? Yeah. Okay, good answer, because you were about to run laps. Good, that was, that was a good job. All right, so we're gonna get up over the patient, okay? On top, you're gonna have your uh, arms locked out, then we're gonna go at least two inches, right? At a rate of 100. You hear the click? We wanna hear that click. You guys are at the right age to remember, retain this information. You have the body weight to push down because an adult, you have to push down on their chest at least two inches. That doesn't seem like much, but if you actually have to do it, it is pretty hard. So you gotta use, but you guys have the body weight. So you can use the mechanics to do so. And the best thing is, is that we hope that you guys remain and remember these simple things that we're gonna teach you today end up next year, high school, college, adulthood. and paying attention and recognizing this is fun to learn, but also very serious. So My name is Brianna McNertney, and I learned a lot today about CPR. It was very hard and painful. My name is Keith McFadden. I just did CPR in our little competition. The biggest thing I learned was I have to keep my beat consistent and keep my hand in the middle of the chest to keep the patient alive or get them alive. My name is Alan Candido and CPR is hard but it's worth saving other people's lives and it's encouraging too. <laughs>